We're good. Everyone good? Groovy. Which is 15 minutes north of Wellington City. Um, I've grown, I've grown up in the hut, so I feel very much at home around here. Yeah. So right now we're in our um, little studio setup in Avalon. Yes, we are. That's. I think that's a good explanation. Maybe two years ago we were like, man, we need a space. Yeah. And it was fine when we finally got this. It was just like, oh, yeah. so so nice to have. We write and yeah. rehearse here. Yeah. We wrote. Four out of five of the songs of our EP, Noon, in here. Yeah. Right. Yeah. We finished them here. Yeah. The past few years, we've been going to someone's house, one of our houses, to sit down and write music. And sometimes, like the whoever's house it is, they're still asleep, and we all rock up, and it just takes a while to get into the into the zone. So yeah, the flatmates just kind of had enough of all of us as well. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's awesome. Basically, it's a TV studio, TV production studio that was built in the 60s, I think. This bit here, there's like a window that looks down into Studio 9. There are massive studios downstairs yeah. where they did like, we'll take you down there. Did all the old TV shows and stuff. There's a great fish and chip shop just across the road called Avalon Fish and Chips. And table tennis. And there's table tennis just down there. That's the rehearsal room over there that we, uh, we get it out with a very home setup of a, like a band setup, but like pretty home done. It's nothing, nothing too flash. We've got all our gear here. Actually, yeah. The rug, I think. The rug really. The rug's a real stand out. Yeah, the rug really ties the room together. Uh, otherwise, it does feel quite um, empty. It's probably the a key to any setup is a good rug. Good rug. Yeah. And this, as you can see, is a great rug, actually. So this is uh, the. There's a door out of our studio down the stairs Come to. Um, to the big studios where we do um, production rehearsals and that sort of thing. So watch your step. And watch your head, because um, it's a bit, it's a bit dangerous. This is, this is, um, I'm not sure which studio this is. Nine. Studio nine. Studio nine. Yeah. So our studio is up there. So that's our studio up there. Yeah. There's a window that's been blocked. So this is kind of the backstage e area where they build a bunch of sets and store stuff for different shoots that are going on um, whilst we're up in our studio. We don't really store anything down here, but there's a bunch of movies and TV shows and stuff that get done. So, yeah, it's quite an interesting place. We always see interesting sets. and It's always buzzing. Yeah. Sorry to cut in, but yeah, this place is always buzzing, especially when, yeah, there's, a, take over. Take especially over. when there's a movie set going on. Get up to the night or whatever. This is Studio 11, so this is where we have some production rehearsals and kind of like serious practices. So if we've got the, obviously we've got a few shows over summer, a few festivals, so this is a nice big area where we can set up the whole, whole setup. Because we went around the States doing all those like radio promo tours and acoustic performances, we thought that while we have time back here in New Zealand and have access to this kind of these kind of facilities, like why not record some of the videos ourselves? So yeah, no. yeah. Lee uh, is directing it. He actually did our woke up late video as well. Yeah. Um, That's him over there in the background. Good day, Hi, Lee. Good day, mate. We're pumped. <laughs> Yeah. 
And I thought I'd be stressing over Haitian with a normal life and a pretty wife.